This morning, you could soon own a piece of a home rental app. Yes, and the Impossible Burger is coming to grocery stores. CBS 13's Diane King Hogg joins us live from New York with all the details. Good morning. Good morning, Jordan and Lori. Well, another round of trade talks between the U.S. and China will continue in Washington today. Talks between deputy trade officials began yesterday and are meant to lay the foundation for negotiations between senior leaders next month. Airbnb announced it will go public next year. The home sharing company gave no other information about the IPO in a one-sentence statement posted yesterday. Earlier this week, Airbnb reported revenue of more than $1 billion in the second quarter of this, this year. And another company is joining the meatless meat wave. The Impossible Burger makes its grocery store debut today. The plant-based meat alternative will be available at California-based Gelson's Markets. It will retail for nearly 9 bucks for a 12-ounce package. There are plans for the bioengineered meat to be available in other su supermarkets throughout the country by the middle of next year. Jordan and Lori. All right, Diane, thank you. And we're hearing a sweet feature for some Toys R Us stores. Mm -hmm, that's right, the revived Toys R Us. Candy Topia is setting up shop at Select Toys R Us this fall as part of its new retail resurgence. The maker of the candy-based art exhibits will launch pop-ups in Toys R Us stores first in Chicago and Atlanta next month and other cities following that. The collaboration is called the Toys R Us Adventure and will feature Candytopia's interactive exhibits with life-size candy sculptures, marshmallow pits, and disco castles. Lori and Jordan. Oh, great. Now the kids aren't only going to bake for toys, but for candy, too. Yeah. All right, all right. All right. <laughs> Thanks, Diane. <laughs>